first thing that struck me about the Bien Manifesto is that it talks about women. And I'm surprised it has never been talked about before. It is now increasingly obvious that if you want developing your country, women, which is half the population, will be able to get you there. The latest United Nations study showed that if you lift the women's capabilities by 1%, you can increase your GDP by 2 to 3%. And the reason is very straightforward. In the past, they were not part of the economy. And so the women's strategy is very critical to the change in our society. The second aspect of the BN's manifesto that I like very much is about youth. We all forget that the future is in the hands of our youth. If we do not invest in our youth, who will invest in our youth? The foreigners? We must invest in our youth. They are our future. They will decide not only the future of our children, they will decide the future of our children's children. The third aspect of the, what I like about the BN Manifesto is about the elderly. And I'm part of that generation. And it is to respect the fact that many Malaysians are today growing old. And they have contributed their whole lives for society. And as a reasonably rich country, there is no reasonable, no reason why we cannot provide our older people better and live a greater sense of community. So I like that about the BN Manifesto very much.